Hey you buddies, Mr. Pugly here coming at your another Wonderlands video. Today I want to talk to you about the legendary shield by the name of Last Gasp. Now Last Gasp is actually a pretty interesting shield and you can use it as a way to get pretty nice synergies depending on which class you're playing. But before we get into the meat and potatoes of the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and follow me on Twitch on the top right. I've been streaming every single day for five hours plus on Wonderlands. So if you're looking for Wonderland streaming content, make sure to follow me on Twitch on the top right right and let's get into it legendary whoa, whoa. no way <laughs> dude. now this shield has a dedicated loot drop source from the boss zom boss which is the second main story boss that you encounter right in shatter grave hollow it's all the way at the end when you spawn in to fast travel location you just have to take the steps down and travel all the way to the end it's a pretty easy farm i think the boss isn't too too hard so you guys won't have any problems killing it at all so what last gasp does is whenever your shield is depleted you get 25 percent fire rate 20 percent reload rate and regenerate ammo but it doesn't tell you the value of the regenerated ammo. I actually tested it, it's 10%. You just get 10% regen ammo right off the bat just having this shield depleted. It's not that much. If you have a decently sized magazine, it's decent, but otherwise the regenerating ammo is kind of negligible. It's definitely better than nothing, I'll say that. So I have a Hyperius sniper rifle of just around 11 magazine right here. So I'm going to purposely get rid of my shield by going into this puddle, just using any frost spell. This is a great way to just get rid of your shield on demand personally for the test I've done and you should see that my magazine on the bottom right is increasing by one every single second so it's confirmed it's just 10 percent another great example is this weapon right here you can notice how fast it fires I'll show you in a few moments right here it shoots about 14 bullets per second so I want you to listen closely listen to how it sounds and then I'm going to deplete my shield and you'll notice that the fire rate gets increased as well so that's very useful so right here you hear it, it's a little bit faster and the reload's faster. It reloaded around that speed as you just saw. Now my shield is back, I'm going to reload again a little bit slower. Now, if you want to utilize this shield, you probably want to get a low level one just so you can easily have it depleted. But I probably recommend you to possibly not do that because you're going to miss out on getting enchantments on your shield and some enchantments are very valuable on your shield. So I'm not sure if I would really recommend getting a low level one. Maybe get one since it's the second main boss of the story just to have it and see if it turns out to be like one of the more meta items. I'm not sure. If, I don't think it really would be you probably want to have one just in case because it is nice otherwise you could play spell shot which has the ability to no longer regenerate shield so you could constantly have this effect at all times or if you're berserker you can reserve your shield to have even less shield so your shields get depleted quicker so you can use those two combos i'm sure there's more combos that i'm not thinking of but those are some combos you can use to utilize the shield to its full extent. I feel like, honestly, it might not be worth it. The ammo regen, 10% is sure nice, but unless you're using a weapon that has like a huge magazine, I would only really consider it maybe being worth it. And you gotta consider that 10% regen is pretty decent amount because Spore Warden can only get to three to six regen per second based on their skill tree. So you kind of have to outweigh the good and bad of the shield. I personally think there's better shields out there, but it's definitely a fun shield to mess around with when you have large magazine weapons and as always a big shout out to the members who make these videos possible we have jace noodles clairvoyant and rick iglesias these are the people who support me as little as five dollars a month and you can also support me as little as five dollars a month by clicking the link in the comments or description or in the top right to become a member the more members we have the closer i get to becoming full time which means more videos for you guys so as always don't forget to like comment subscribe and i hope you all have a great day <laughs> Bye bye and the last shall be first to immerse in a pass out heat facing him up with a moxie melt till he woke up drowning in chachiki hell war in a cave with a torch on a wall then a window arrangement of porcelain dolls